The last thing before we go tonight, a death-defying rescue. Seven students and a teacher trapped in a cable car 900 feet above a ravine in Pakistan. They've all been rescued. The group was traveling to school in a remote mountainous area when the cable car became stranded halfway across the ravine. Our own Raf Sanchez has more on their 14-hour ordeal. Tonight, a perilous rescue nearly a thousand feet off the ground. Seven children and one teacher trapped on this cable car on their way to school, left dangling over a ravine after an overhead line snapped. Pakistani military helicopters circling above, lowering commandos by rope, but trying not to shake the car with the force of their rotors. Cable cars are a common way to travel in remote areas with poor roads. And with crowds gathering below, one man making a frantic call to local TV from on board the car. It's a matter of human lives, he says. The authorities should rescue all of us as soon as possible. And then, on the helicopter's third pass, success. This student stepping off the car and lifted to safety. The choppers forced to land when the sun set. But locals and rescue teams working in the darkness, using improvised pulleys to get everyone else to safety. When the uh, helicopter operation could not uh, go on uh, in the dark, uh, I think the rescuers uh, made this brave decision because they didn't want the kids to be waiting all night and the parents to be suffering from anxiety. So I think this was a very brave decision on the part of uh, the army. Pakistan's prime minister tweeting, all the kids have been successfully and safely rescued. A happy ending to what was so nearly a tragedy. Raf Sanchez, NBC News. Thank goodness for those brave rescuers working through the night so that everyone can make it back to their family safe and sound. Oh.